Hey YouTube, Mike here. How are we doing today? Hope we all had a good week. All right, today um, uh, I'm going to do a review on that Milwaukee three-inch cutoff saw. Now uh, I normally give it a month, but I've had a couple of um, requests to do a little bit more in-depth uh, review on it and um, demo. But this week, uh, put it on the truck, and for s this week we had. Uh, quite a few jobs that we got to use it extensively on. One job, uh, about 20 pieces of 3A threaded rod, about 8 inches long, and then another job we had to cut into sheetrock, and another one we had to cut through the tile, the old uh, 4x4 tile into the uh, grout line. And the thing worked really good. What I did was I paired it with the uh, Milwaukee um, portable vacuum. Now, it, it did really good with, with the tile and the sheetrock. A little bit of dust. Um, it, it, it's the filter, the suction on this is more for cleanup. You could use it like on the sanders and stuff like that. But um, And of course the filter got really clogged inside of it. So I did order the Milwaukee, um, not sure of the number. I'll, I'll have it in about a week and a half. Um, it's their backpack vacuum and it's the HEPA. And it's got uh, double the suction of the um, portable, of this portable vacuum. But, you know, once I get it, use it, um, I'll give you a review on it. All right. Um, I'll go through the tool in a second, but let's just start. I got a piece of 3A threaded rod here. Now, the blade is uh, probably more than 50% worn down, um, the, the carborundum blade. Now, it also comes with, um, it's a fiberboard, wonderboard, sheetrock blade, and it comes with the, a tile, a thin kerf tile blade. So, um, I'm using um, the, the M12 Red Lithium XC battery uh, with um, probably a little less than half the size of the cutoff. All right, um, got, a, got forward and reverse. We're cutting this in forward and got just nice and slow right through. It's worn down a little bit, but as you can see, it cuts nice. Um, I mean, bandsaw, yes, the bandsaw will cut a little faster, but um, you know, with the bandsaw, you really need two hands and a vise. Other than that, someone could just mark it and cut the, you know, cut the um, thread rod right in hand, right there on the site. If you don't happen to have a vise, all right. Let's try the tile now. Now, to swap out, remove the battery, of course, on all the tools, open up the guide, press the red button, which unlocks, pull it out of the guide, take your Allen key, blade lock, it goes clockwise. Now, it comes with a 3-8 collar and it comes with what is this um, 716 collar so you can use two different arbor, arbor sizes now I did um, Milwaukee does not have blades out yet but I will able to find them on supplyhouse.com oh and I like to thank all of the subscribers that located that uh, tote for me and I ended up um, uh, ordering one off Amazon. So you just find your way in there, lock it back. It's not like a grinder where you can move it back and forth. It just stays in one position. Remove the cap for the uh, vacuum. I have a piece of ceramic tile. Move, make sure it's unlocked always. Got three bars left. 
it's not, like I said, it does make a dust. It doesn't have that, that best of suction. Just picture grinding up. Just picture grinding up the grout line of tile. But it works really well. And I mean, as you can see, it makes dust. But it didn't make that much of a dust when we were using it. It's just, with sheetrock, we change the shower bodies. And we cut into a closet or the back wall of the shower body. We'll take all the trim off. I'll stick a long drill bit through. Tell me where exactly the back half of the shower body is. We cut in an 18 by 18 access panel. So I'll mark 17 by 17 so the access panel is slipping. It's in a closet. Or I'll just bring a piece of, like the white or chalk, you know, the, you get in Home Depot two foot by four foot. It's almost like the dry erase board and screw that into the wall just to, to cover it. You know, it saves people on getting someone to repair the drywall. So we'll cut a 17 by 17 inch. I have a, a piece of wood, thin piece of 1 8 wood that's already templated. Put it up at the level, scribe it. Then I took this with this blade right here and just zip, zip, zip. This is normally a stud that the shower buddy is mounted on zip it for all the way around but because it goes de it goes in the depth of cut is five eighths of an inch is the depth of cut so you know half and sheetrock no problem and scores the, 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 the two by four and just pop out the that section if the people want to have it repaired they have the section to, to you know take back up there or you know when we're done we just snap in the access panel and people are happy as a clam. So um, that's what I really like the tool for. Um, th the threaded rod, yeah, it takes a little bit, um, but it does cut it. Um, like I said, if you're gonna do it right there at the site, if you got some threaded rod to cut, it, it'll, it'll do nice. Okay, um, we picked up, and it took a while for, to get it, the new 12 volt uh, M18, 18 volt battery, which has 200, what is that? 216 watt hours. That's like ridiculous power. Now, this is a, this is a brand new one. We got a second battery, uh, came in yesterday. I, I just finished charging it. Again, you know, all of them have the fuel gauge on it. Um, the heavy duty electric, it's the Inchin 916 Milwaukee. Um, Rotary demo hammer. Oh, unbelievable. We chopped through concrete to get to a sewer, um, the top of a sewer that the, the, the sewer was going through. We had to get the top off because we were putting the new sewer in. And it chopped through this without a problem. And not even one bar, pretty much one bar was gone. But it still showed um, four bars. Uh, gives the tool double the power, uh, double the run time, um, 199 the battery is, you know, 200 bucks, but um, you don't need to carry corded tools anymore. Um, I, I really wish they'd come out with a corded threading machine after one inch, because uh, that would then, I would have absolutely no corded machines on my truck. 
So, um, excellent battery, does bring the weight up of the tool by about two and a half pounds uh, compared to the 9 battery in this. So, the, the battery is about four pounds, uh, three and a half pounds, to, you know, three and a half, four pounds. Um, <clears throat> it does bring the weight of it. Uh, the demo hammer, the inch and nine sixteenths, not so much because of the way it's balanced, but the super hog, yeah, it brings the ass end of the tool, um, it, it puts a lot of weight on the ass end of the tool. So especially when you're drilling up, but three inch, four inch holes without even blinking an eye. All right, um, I had a, you know, I, I'm, I'm telling you about this and all, uh, but seeing is believing, and I always like to watch, um, somebody using the tool. But a lot of these tools that I, I buy, and, then, and I bought a second one of these, so I have one here in the, in the shop. Um, a lot of them are on my, my work truck, and, and you know, it's not Mike's plumbing shop, it's Mike's wood shop. But I've had quite a few requests of me videoing um, using these tools um, on the job site. Now, like I said, it's Mike's wood shop, not Mike's plumbing shop. So I really didn't want to do anything. Uh, and if you want to see me, you can always go over to the Renai guy and you can see you know, what I do for there for my other channel. Um, but um, put it in the comments or send me a message if you'd like to see it. And what I'll do is I'll do like a montage of maybe a 30, 40 minute video of using the super hog, using the hammer drill, using uh, this tool, using my, my metal saw, cutting saw, stuff like that. Yeah, not like saws, all saws, all, everybody uses it. You don't need, I mean, it's all, it's all, it's all, you know, so, uh, but they asked to see it. So if you guys think it's a good idea, put it in the comments, put it in the, um, you know, send me a message and, um, you know, I'll, like I said, I'll do a montage of it and you can actually see the tools being used, um, you know, on, on the job site, the press tools, the crimp tools and, 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 and stuff like that. Okay. So, um, oh, and if anybody's wondering, and I, I have two of these, I, Instead of having a regular basic bench mount, as you can see, um, and I, I've had people ask me before, what I ended up doing was taking two three-quarter pieces of plywood, gluing and screwing them together, putting the five-star turn knobs, quarter inch, two of them, underneath the MFT table. Uh, I just lost that puppy. And, oh, here it is. And I just take some washers and some bolts, and I just put it right through, countersunk, to mount the um, uh, actual boards together and then some leg bolts and then I just angle it into the corners and as you can see these things will push up and I store it under my table with the star knobs, the five, the, um, five hole knobs and um, it works great. I have this one um, and then I have a larger six inch. This is the four inch, and I have a six inch one under that table for when I'm doing like heavier grinding. And it works perfect. It just locks right through here and holds, as you can see, it holds down perfect. All right, YouTube. Uh, again, I'd like to thank everyone for the subscribes and all of the comments. I love the comments um, and the likes. And if you'd like to ask a question or um, you want a mic switch up sticker, I'll, it, again, in the description below, I will include my, um, my email and just shoot me over the question or shoot me over your, your mailing address and we'll send you out a sticker. All right? Um, and I'll include the model numbers. Oh, this tool is 130, tool only. So everything you see except the battery and charger. Uh, and that's the way I bought them, tool only. And um, the 12 uh, battery is 199. It's 199 everywhere, Home Depot. You know, Lowe's don't sell, Milwaukee. Um, I get them from my, my plumbing supply house. Um, that's where I get them. They get them fast. So, uh, same prices, same warranty, same everything. All right, I think that's it. Um, all right, you too. Um, you all have a very safe week, and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.